this process has begun. Already four political parties have collapsed and deregistered. Yeah. I can assure you that before the end of the year, we're going to have many other political parties. Some that even have got seats in parliament that are going to fold into Mkonto Wesizwe so that you can form one united front of progressive forces. Yeah. President Zuma says a simple thing, that the reason why we're under colonialism is because the settlers fought us as separate small groups who yes. yes. were never united as black we people. United. They fought us and defeated us as small groups. Yes. And then later on they combined all of us and say they're in charge of us. Yeah. We can't make the same mistake yes. of fighting in different corners yes. when there's a revolutionary progressive platform which we must consolidate to fight for total emancipation, for total freedom. Yes. That is the struggle that we are signing up for. So tomorrow our task is quite simple and straightforward. We are sending kids to Etegoni Municipality yes. and then we are going to just make sure that he prepares for the other councillors who are going to take over this municipality and take it towards prosperity. Because whatever we do, mm. what must define Mkonto Wesize must be excellence. Yes. We must not do mediocrity. Yes. We must not replace mediocrity with mediocrity. Yes. We must always display excellence. Yes. And we believe that our councillor here is going to demonstrate the excellence that defines all of us. Yes. Let's remain disciplined, comrades, all of us. Tomorrow, whom we can, who can. Let's go to all the VPs and search all the voters. Yeah. Let's not disappoint the president. Yeah. He is sure of the VPs and the wards that we have visited. But let's make sure that we then get our first ward here in a Tequin. It's currently a Tequin without any doubt is the home of Mkonto Wesu. Yeah. Yeah. Go and check the results of the 29th of May 2024. Yeah. Mkonto Wesu got more than 50% of the vote here. Yeah. Yeah. And number two is the DA at 24%. Yeah. Number three is called Gogo at 15%. Yeah. And the rest do not exist here in yeah. There is no any other organization, so we are rest assured. Yes. But when we send Mkise to the council, he's just going to prepare for all the 86 words which are going to be won directly by MK Yenete Queen. The leadership of the region gave us an assurance that of the 111 words, Yenete Queen 86 are already in the bag. And that is not theory. It's not just a wish. Yes. It is the outcome of the 29 May elections. Yes. MK was a decisive winner yes. of more than 86 words here in Etequin. Yes. In some of the words in Umlas, in Kwamash, MK was more than 76%, more than 80% of the yes. vote. Yes. There is no way that we can lose the support that we have entrenched in Kwamashu, in Hammersdale, in, uh, in Numlaz and all the areas. Yes. So our role now is to consolidate the ground which has already been given yeah. to Mkonda Wesiza by the people of Etequin. Yeah. Yeah. This must be the only metro where there's a decisive outright winner and that winner must be Mkonda Wesiza. Yeah. The rest of the metros are going to be negotiated. Yeah. But this one is already in the bag. So this one is just going to check there how the seats are arranged so that when the rest of the battalion comes, they know where to sit. They know where the offices are. So we're going to send him from tomorrow onwards to prepare for the battalion that is going to come and lead 